Tonight, Kroger in the crosshairs. A group of moms targeting the retailer calling for a change in the store's gun policy. But not everyone agrees with it. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaket has that fiery debate tonight. Today, the open carry debate takes a new twist here at Kroger, and we're covering everything from the grocery store to the gun shop. The advertisements grab your attention. People in the grocery store with semi-automatic weapons standing next to people doing things forbidden under Kroger store policy. While Kroger says the guns are okay, as long as you're following Michigan's open carry law, a powerful anti-gun lobby group is trying to get the America's second largest supermarket chain to change its policy. We would rather there were not be guns in our stores. Not surprisingly, there's passionate reaction to the ads across Metro Detroit. At Action Impact Firing Range in Southfield, lots of people who open carry come to practice with their guns. And guess what? They've got some pretty strong opinions about Kroger also. It's not necessary. It really isn't necessary. Neil Emanuel is the head firearms instructor and manager at Action Impact on 8 Mile. How does he feel about the issue? The main problem with the open carry and as instructors, we do not recommend open carry. Why? Because now you've shown your cards. If somebody wants to assault you or rob you, and all of a sudden they notice that you have a gun on your hip, now they're not going to come in front of you and say give it up. Now they'll try and sneak behind you and, and surprise you. Part of a statement to 7 Action News, Kroger says, we don't want to put our associates in a position to have to confront customers or enforce gun laws. Our longstanding policy on this issue is to follow state and local laws and to urge customers to be respectful of others while shopping. If you want to see those ads, we put them on our website. Just go to WXYZ.com. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. All right, Simon, thank you.